With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students. So the question is induction at the point O if the wire carries a current I is. So here this diagram contain three sections. Suppose the magnetic field due to this infinite semi infinite wire is B1 and the magnetic field due to semi circular wire is B2 and the magnetic field due to this semi infinite wire is B3. Now first of all calculate B1. B1 will be mu naught upon 4 pi. It will be I upon R that is due to semi infinite wire and its direction is according to right hand thumb rule is will be minus j cap that is negative y direction and the magnetic field due to semi circle that is b2 will be equal to mu naught upon 4 pi pi i by r and its direction will be minus k cap and the magnetic field due to this semi infinite wire will be mu naught upon 4 pi i by r minus j cap. These are the magnetic field due to different section of this arrangement. So to calculate the net magnetic field that is B net will be equal to B1 plus B2 plus B3. So adding vectorly here we get it will be mu naught upon 4 pi minus 2i by r j cap plus mu naught upon 4 pi pi i by r minus k cap. Now taking common that is mu naught upon 4 pi i by r it will be minus 2j minus pi k. Now we have to calculate its magnitude. So its magnitude that is b net magnitude can be written as mu naught upon 4 pi i by r under root 2 square 4 plus pi square. So that means the correct answer of this question will be option 3. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.